seeing that on camera, Noah, was something. I think I'm a believer. After this, I oh, think yeah. there's something out there. I don't think I should be up here. What the hell is that? Skinwalker. Yeah, right. I just didn't believe it. A skinwalker in Navajo tradition is a shapeshifter. It easily ranks as the most intensely studied paranormal hotspot in history. Yeah, f you. I just saw you, you f Oh, are we about to find out what the f this thing looks like? These animals are incredibly strong and they can very easily kill or seriously injure a person. It depends on you know what that skinwalker wants at that time. No, dude, don't do that. What? This is too much. Your intent definitely to hurt people. It's always a negative intent. This is the exact spot <laughs> Oh my oh, shit, dude. Now I'm getting scared, bro. You good there, Riv? You wanna yank out? <laughs> that. Okay, fine. Can I I'm not gonna rip out a hair. Simba. <laughs> <laughs> Here, look at me, Ryan. Simba. Oh, tonight we are investigating at the old Ferrari farm here in Nevada. Now this place is super well known for being such a mystery. And lately, the hauntings have been ramping up. Ooh. Cue the music. Lucas, come here. Skinwalkers take the shape of anything and that thing has not ran off yet. Yep, 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 yep. What I say, Jeff? Extracurricular entities. <laughs> I got something you like. <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. How did that happen? Yeah, didn't make it one day and this is how we turned up. In the 1800s, I believe there was an old sawmill that used to stand on the property. But since like 1912, it's been in the family for generations. History is saying that before the Ferraris, this land used to be native land. And you know what that means. Spooky dookies. <laughs> What is also super weird is that we were told that there is a Native American body buried somewhere on this ranch. Nobody knows why that body is there, but it could be why some pretty weird things have been happening to the family for years all over their property. There's been a few things, the old house that have burned down. I was sitting there talking in real depth one time with someone and all of a sudden we're just sitting there and the fans start going, powers off everything. Um, there's a little boy, one here one time that on a field trip. As we go down, you can see this and even here it's pretty flat, right? So the first time he comes and he's not like there was animals killed there, there's a girl buried there, all this stuff that he would have no idea how it was. Next year he comes back on a field trip right down the down the lane there, all of a sudden a rock starts rolling completely flat. So there's been some strange things. What makes this even worse is that they're right next to the river and that's running water and plenty of energy for these spirits. Keep in mind that the Ferrari family have been living on this land for generations and a few of their family members have passed on the property along the way so their family members could be there as well. Not only that, many other people have died here in this area as well. Oftentimes they find bodies over there by the river in this exact stretch of land. Which makes it such a mystery because why just their land? Investigation is underway after a body was found in the Truckee River today. At this time, there's no word on how the body ended up in the river. Officials haven't said whether the cause of death is suspicious, but they are investigating. Police department responded to a call of a dead body in the Truckee River and are currently investigating. This is a developing story and will continue to update you both on air and online as soon as we learn more. Here's the best part. Recently, they showed us a picture that they got on their security cameras of what looks like a white apparition standing in the middle of their property. We put up some night cams over there, so basically just some trail cams just to kind of see. And pulled up one night, just started looking through it, and all of a sudden there's this image going through. It looks like maybe a woman in a white dress that was going by or running or whatever. And I don't know, just one of those strange things that I couldn't figure it out. Now to us, this kind of looks like it could be a Native American woman or just a woman in a white dress and or white gown.
But all these stories and the things they've told us, coupled with what's going on there at the ranch, is starting to make us think that this might be a skinwalker. The only way we're gonna find out is to go and investigate. But before we do go, if you guys do wanna go to the Ferrari Farms and do some type of event there, their link will be down in the description. It's time to hit the road. Hello. Hello. Can I touch your nose? Hi. <laughs> if we don't end up catching anything, you know, good, we can just hang out with the animals. <laughs> Hello. Look at all these guys. Hey. Hi. Get your finger out there. There you go. There you go. There you go. You want some? There you go. There you go. <laughs> all right, come on, we gotta get back to business. <laughs> I went knuckle deep. They're so cute. Okay, so we are going to the section where they had caught what looks to be at least a, a female in a white dress or a white nightgown. And they caught it on their surveillance footage. So we're gonna see if we could come up with anything, find out if the spirit is in this area. If not, we have a couple more ideas on where a spirit or the spirit could be. It might be a little noisy because the one of the main roads, or there is a road right here. Sometimes it's busy, I don't know. We'll see, see what we can get. Okay. If anybody is here on this property and can hear me after this We're here to try to find out your story. The owners of this property had caught you on their camera. If you don't know what a camera is, they were able to see you. And I know not many people can see you to this day, but if you can hear me, I'd like to introduce all of us. My name is Ryan. My name is Wyatt. My name is Frank. My name is River. Now you must know Frank, because he's been here all his life. If you can please give us a sign in any way that you can hear us and understand what I'm saying. Fat chance, bro. Fat chance. <laughs> Hang on. Can you let that go? If you can hear me? I don't know if that, that could have been me. I don't if, think so. If you can see me and understand me, this object right here, if you come up to this metal rod like this, It'll start to buzz and light up. Nothing's gonna hurt you in any way. I'm gonna back up. That object right there will not hurt you. It won't harm you. That was cool. <laughs> Wind doesn't do that, does it? No, can't. Never had that? Do you understand what I'm saying? That object is a lot easier for your type of energy, for what you do produce. Maybe we can try and give you a couple of answers or you can give us a couple of answers. I also have this object here that you can physically use your words, whether it's a sentence or just one word. If you do want to talk to us, this object will give you the ability to tell us what you're doing here. So we always turn it on airplane mode so there is no interference whatsoever. Spear talker. I'm gonna go set it over here, so try and listen clear. I'm setting the object right here. Use your words, please. Maybe you can give us a name for a start, or you could just let us know why you're here. To our understanding, what they had captured was that you're a woman, either in a white dress or possibly even a white gown. Maybe if you have enough energy or if you need energy, these objects here, in River's hand and Wyatt's hand, you can use that energy to hopefully give us as much information as you can and or even try and show yourself. We. 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 Yikes. More than one. So are you saying that there's more than one of you? What we're trying to find out is, are you from the native times when, when We're trying to find out if you're Native American, it just keeps going. You guys see that? That means somebody's right here. Excuse me if somebody is here. Ritual. 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 You wait, see that? Wait, hold on, it hold did, on, hold it on. It went purple, so when, when it goes purple, that means that they're this close. What if at one point they use this spot for rituals? Native Americans, they do lots of rituals. Okay. Lots of stuff like that. This could have been. Well, let's not jump the gun. Let's not. No, if, if they're natives, it, I would take it as they probably want us to do one. That's what they would do oh. okay. to speak to somebody. That's actually true. 
Not that we know how to do that, but... Do you know where we are, by any chance? Maybe you can give us an answer on what you see. Are you the woman in white? I think that's a yes. That's all the way. Did you just see that? It all lit up. You guys see that? So you are indeed the woman in white. I'm trying to find out if that's what you were answering, if you are the woman in white. Left. Left? Is that why it's not going anymore? It was just doing a whole lot. Oh. Maybe. You just walked away. Yeah. Are you familiar with the owners of this land? Maybe you can give us a sign if that's a yes. Help me. Oh. Help me. Oh my dude, I am so chilled. Did you hear that? Help me. What is it that you need help with? Are you are you stuck on this land? Are you trying to tell us you're stuck? Because if you are, we can try our best. They just keep going. Dude, what is going on? If you don't mind, maybe stick with us through this night because we're going to be here for a while. But we'll try our best as soon as we do leave. Wow. It seems like this object right there, the one that buzzes and lights up, it seems like that one is a little bit easier for you to answer. We'll just use that device for you to say a yes. If a no, just don't touch it. Thank you. Are you okay with following us around? Are you able to do that? Just on this property? Because we're going to make our way over that way. And like I said, if you want us to try our best to help you, we will do so. Please give me a sign. Something's wrong. Help me, something's wrong. The stories, bro. Skinwalkers, could something be. is wrong. That's the first we've never seen. What I'm thinking is like there could be a, like spirits on here that were probably even a part of the family. Or they could have been native. This is what we're trying to find out. We're trying to find out if they were a part of the family because this family has been on this farm for generations. And before it was native land. There is a Native American woman who was buried, supposedly, over there. Somewhere on this property. Somewhere on the property. So we're dealing with both things. Mm -hmm. We don't know yet, which is, I sure hope we find out. Creepy. Something's wrong. Creepy. What the f What? That's creepy. Can you help me or please help me? Something's wrong. Creepy. That's hard to interpret. Is it okay with you if we make our way over that way? Any way you can give us a sign real quick. Thank you. That means they're literally this close. All right, I guess I just wanted to check this out. I kind of want to leave it alone for a little bit, see if anything happens. So we have their surveillance footage that will catch any movement. It'll start to take photos when something triggers it, something walks in front of it. So we'll see if we do get anything left on there tonight. This is kind of creepy in and of itself, what's coming out of the, the spirit box. Yeah. How do you... Wait, take photo, dude. That thing took a photo. <gasps> we were just talking about the photo that was captured, and it just said take photo. Like I said, we're going to make our way that direction. If you need anything, please come with us. We have all these other objects that if you'd like to communicate, we would really appreciate if you can give us a little bit more information on who you are. Wow. Dude, that was amazing. That was weird. <laughs> there's just, guys, I just want you guys to understand there's so much that we need to cover and we could stay in one spot. Ryan. Did he just say my name? Yeah. That's no my God. Name. No way. That's the second time ever that this device has ever said my name. Dude. We introduced ourselves. Right. That's how they'd know. Oh, dude, that's amazing. Man. What did it say? Man. Man? It said man. You guys were talking about the Native American woman. I don't think it's a woman. I think it's a man. A man? But think about it back then. They all had the long hair. Oh. They were like prideful of it. Yeah. I don't know. I always thought the uh, picture didn't really look like a woman. As I was saying, we have so many locations we want to hit tonight. It's not just that section that is hot. There's 
other sections that we do need to go see if we can continue to communicate. There's a couple of spirits that we are really trying to get in touch with. And I mean, if we are talking to the Native American woman, that would be amazing. But there are also a lot of other people who have passed away on this land. That and think about this. So in my mind, all of us learn, right? Mm -hmm. Say this was native land at one point, but there is a, a spirit that does still wander around on this land and is Native American, but learns just like everybody else. Mm -hmm. What if they learned how to speak? How else would you be able to communicate with people who only really speak English? Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. Like a lot of people are like, oh, how does this spirit know English? Guys, how do you learn different languages? You learn. With that being said, let's go to the barn. Okay, if somebody did follow us, we're just here to try to gather some information. I'm gonna go ahead and explain this device, this object. I'm gonna set it on the ground. If you can, and if you are physically able to do this, all I want you to do is please walk in front of this object like that. It should detect your movement. If you're walking, I don't know if you do walk, if you can just walk in front of that, set that object off. It'll make music and let us know that you are here. If anybody is here, and if you could just give us a quick sign. They may have followed us now. Is this the same person we spoke to? Remember, touch that for yes. Use your energy, please. Thank you. What is that? Is it like really windy out? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Is that normal? Yeah, there's a few noises usually, but not, not much now. There's no wind, no nothing. Is there somebody up there? That was different. That was a little different, huh? Can you please come over here? There's no animals on the other side of these walls. There's nothing else. Just us in here right now. That was a good one. Thank you. I don't know if you're able to make this one go off, but I'll show you one more time on how it works. Just walk in front of it, just like that, please. Move in front of it. And if you need energy, use this object right here in River's hand. We just want to know if you are okay with speaking to us. If you're not, we won't bother you. Why do the frogs make it kind of creepier? Yeah. Honestly, right? You ever heard of the toad that eats people? Uh-uh. That toad's here. It is? Yeah. Well, now I gotta know. Well, apparently this toad only eats Whoa. people. They all went silent. They're listening too. It only eats yeah. people named Wyatt. The silence of the frogs. If you don't know this object, you can use your words. Please let us know some information, whether it's your name, male, female. If you're from this land, if you lived on this land, anything you'd like to tell us. Okay, I moved it away just in case because I don't want any interference or anything. That's a really close grab. No one knows what they used to call my grandmother. What? No one knows what they used to call my grandmother. Are you family? If yes, please hold on to that object right there. Like I said, we're just trying to get some information on who is here and who would like to speak. Memories here. Oh! Whoa! Memories here. So are you saying your family? Ryan. Again? Twice? Again? Two in a row's never happened. Never. Literally never. Why are you saying my name? Run now. Oh my God. Ryan, run now. Is there something we need to worry about? Because somebody was saying that they needed help. Is that it? Because that's creepy. It all sounds like a baby. Photo. Again, photo. whoever was in the photo, man, has to be speaking to us. Somebody was trying to warn us of somebody. 
Something creepy. Is there not something good on this land that you're trying to warn people about? The problem is, we're not able to see anybody physically with our eyes unless if they have that energy or they want us to see them. That's why we're trying to get information. So if you want us to run from something, if you want us to stay away from something, you might have to let us know what it is or who, if that's okay. The house. The house that used to be here? The one that... You said there was a house on this land at once, and you said that the fan would go on by itself, right? Exactly. That's the one that we were in deep conversation with when the fan went by itself. Wow. That's oh it? Oh my god! Is that it? I don't know! Was it something from that house? Someone? What is going on? This is very odd. They're trying to warn us though. And I think another spirit is a family member of yours. Which is your grandma, right? Yeah, the one they called Nona. That was... Just said bye. After telling us to go. To run. Maybe someone warning us and since we're not listening, they're... They're, they're done. Like, okay. they're, not, they're not helping us anymore. Check this out. What? You get something? He just took two photos. Of Frank. First one. Back to back. Or No shot. No Gone. shot. Your grandma was behind you. Yeah. She really? Your grandma was behind <laughs> you. You can see the orb. Look at it. And then it's gone. Whoa, dude. I am chill. Uh -huh. <laughs> Is there somebody still here at least? Cursed. Cursed. Cursed, Cursed land. Maybe that's what they're warning us. Cursed land, that could mean that so just, many different things. I mean, you, got, you guys don't deal with any like really crazy things that you're like, why is this happening? No, there's no, it's not negative. It's, there's right. always been positive energy yeah. here, not negative. Yeah. What is it that we need to worry about? We were just told that there's not negativity here. Is there something nobody knows about? Did you guys... Did just hear that? Demon. Demon! Oh, there it is. No. Right no. No, I just heard a footstep on the other side, and it sounds exactly like stepping in normal gravel, normal dirt. It was on the other side, right on the other side of that wall. Do you, yeah. you want me to go see the demon? Yeah, we might as well. We might as well. You come with me. Take this. <laughs> Take this with you. Okay, so now we just found out. Why is it that nobody really deals with the evil here, though? That's what we're trying to find out as well. Unless if they have been, but haven't noticed. Because that we, has happened also. No, it's always been positive energy here, and that's the thing. Is it's never been the negative or something like that. So what was it saying? Somebody was saying when we were over there, the device said something about not conjuring, but uh, ritual. I and mean, we were trying to figure out like what the whole ritual thing is about. I mean, it could be anything. We were even saying back in the day, the natives would do like some type of ritual. Right. We don't know if that's Sacrifices, what they were saying. Maybe something Sacrifice. like that. Then they go and say cursed. Land could be cursed. House could be cursed. Something. We ask, what should we be afraid of? What's creepy? So on and so forth. Right away, they say demon. Yeah, that's not coincidence. No. But the thing is, like, could they be actually talking about a demon? Or, or someone who's else. evil who can portray themselves to be like, you know, this guy's evil. He's a demon. You know? Yeah. Where exactly is this demon located? Where is this evilness? Are they watching us right now? We're trying to get you to give us a sign. Yeah, I mean, you can use that to speak if you want. Sacred ground. I mean, native there's, land. There's the native ground. That's the native Sacred land. Sacred ground. I'm going to be honest with you if, if you understand what I'm saying. I don't think it's an actual demon. It's something else. Do you agree with that? But to your knowledge, that's probably just what you know something like that as. Can you give me a sign that you understand what I'm saying? Maybe I'm even close to what you're trying to tell us. Okay, that's better, thank you. How long has that been? A long time. A good, good solid time. Why is it that the owners here have not dealt with that? Whatever this is, it must be pretty reclusive. Rest. Rest. They've been resting? Could be off, way off. I mean, that was actually pretty good. Not gonna lie. How do we wake it up? Maybe they're not after you guys whatsoever. That's probably why you guys have been not dealing with any of that. What we got earlier was revenge. 
revenge. Not exactly. revenge on, on them. No. Maybe on something that happened to someone. Wow. This is like huge mystery. You know what I'm like it's it's literally a giant mystery. We're getting told all kinds of information. Nobody out there? I heard it. One hundred percent. I know exactly what that sound sounds like. It sounded like somebody scuffing their foot. Exactly like that on the other side. I was asking, I said, why is it, you know, that you guys haven't dealt with the, anything? And I was like, where is this evil or whatever? And I said, are they like watching us from a distance? Are they doing something? And then I heard that. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. If you're good, if you mean well, hold on to that object right there. Please. That just kind of indicates us and, and lets us know a little bit more. I love that. Loki, I'm like on. I really life. like that. Thank you so much. What we want to find out is what is this bad energy? Who, who is it? What is it? And why do you want to warn us about this thing? Please try and give us that information. We're going to be making our way towards that direction where there is a possible burial site of a Native American, either woman or man. Okay, I think we should definitely go. Let's make our way uh, into the creepy area. Something that we did not realize, but we were told earlier, is this goat is actually River's girlfriend. You're so mean. <laughs> I mean, happily, honestly. Something that we were actually told earlier, but didn't realize, is there is a full moon tonight. So this is kind of starting to make more sense on why these spirits are so active. What's that? What the f was that? Point that way. What is that? Ain't no animal making that noise over here. It stops. So there's a full moon tonight, and that makes a lot of sense on why these spirits are so active tonight. Right now we are making our way towards the back section where there is apparently a Native American, either man or woman, we're trying to find out. Also, as we were walking over there, we were going to go shut off the camera so that we can do a reset for all of our cameras so that we can swap out batteries, make sure we have enough for everything. When we were over there, we heard what sounded like somebody was literally walking in the bushes right next to the camera. Yo, there's somebody there. What the f is that? That's, that's dude, how? That's Hello? How? You're not supposed to be over here. This way, this way, go, go, go. We're gonna find out what it is right now. Hey, whatever it is, it's huge. I see it. What is it? Careful, dude. What are you doing? It's coming towards you. What the f is this, dude? Come out, please. We were literally just coming to move this camera right here and something started moving, but it's huge, which doesn't make sense. The only thing I can think of is a horse. There's no horse. There's nothing. We went to go walk around to see if it was any animal, but that was no animal, dude. These sounded like human footsteps, multiple branches breaking in each step. Was no horse, was no deer. We had no eyes looking at us. We're gonna go head back over there. All kinds of weird things happen here. Weird sort of energy. We're trying to find out. This is why we're here. So if you think about it, we were being warned about something creepy. So in my mind, I'm thinking right away a creature. When I asked, what should we be worried about? Demon. The reason why we're getting more and leaning more towards some type of creature, and the only kind of creature we could think of on native land, is some sort of a what people call skinwalker. Now nobody really knows exactly what a skinwalker is. So here's what we were trying to kind of figure out. To their knowledge, this is what they think. It's like, you know, when somebody is crazy, back in the old days, they would say that you're the demon. You're a devil. You know what I'm saying? 
So somebody could have just been warning us about something evil and we're trying to find out where this thing is because they don't deal with it. Then I was also thinking the owner's grandma was just talking to him, was showing him that she is there. She could also be protecting all of them from this said evilness. I've heard it many times. I've heard this kind of thing happening. We're over here. We're trying to see if somebody wants to communicate with us. Somebody that doesn't want to be seen by the people who own this property. But we know about you. We were told. You know what's boys? What? Look where we are. Crossroads. One, two. With the energy that we're able to provide you, you should be able to show yourself. If anybody knows any information and, and hears me and can see us, I want to let you know that we can't physically see you. So we have these objects that can pick up your energy. We want to know where you are. We want to know who you are. This right here gives you the ability to speak. If you come up to me, use your energy, and you will be able to use a word or a sentence. Please come up to us and give us information. Show us who you are. I'm talking to the creature or what people call you as a demon. We want you to come and speak with us. If you don't mean harm, but if that's what people see you as, maybe you're a protector of what is said to be somebody buried over there that is a Native American. Give us a sign, please. Now speak into this. Contained. They're contained. Containing the, the evil. Use your energy, please. Somebody's showing us that they're here. Can you help? Again, again. Help us, can you help? Dude, that's that same bullshit. What if we turn the light out? Complete darkness. Let me shut it up. Shut the light out. At this point, we are vulnerable because we cannot see. So if you want to give us that sign that you are here, then come on, please. What'd you just hear? Branch just broken. That was a thick ass branch. Then come on, please. What'd you just hear? Branch just broken. That was a thick ass branch. Dude, something's wrong with this area, man. There's something wrong with this area. The frogs are completely silent still, like someone's just watching us. This Native American, was it an adult? Or was it a, a, a child? Or a teenager? Dude. Seven. Young. Seven. Holy shit. Young and seven. Okay. Male or female? Boy or girl? Please. Right there, right there, right there, right there. Movement. Complete movement. There's like gravel steps. Yeah, exactly what I heard. Come over here. Please. Dancing. This is eerie as f Dude. Dancing is part of their Native American their ritual. rituals. Let's try this. I've got an object here, a torch, a light, whatever you see it as. If you can complete the circuit and turn it on for us, that would be amazing. That would show us that you can understand what we're saying and you are capable of doing so. Flashing. Flashing! It just said flashing. I said it right there, if you can turn that on, let us know that you can understand us. That'll give us a good indicator that we are speaking with somebody, please. So if you can turn that on, that'll give us a sign. There it is. Thank you so much. We heard about somebody evil out here. Probably somebody who just likes to kind of keep their distance. 
please shut that flashlight, that torch, whatever you see it as. Turn it off, please. Thank you. Thank you so much. Is there something evil out here? Can you turn that on? That'll answer it as a yes. Somebody was trying to warn us about something. Manifest everything you can possible. Thank you so much. Take your time. Turn it off. And then I'll ask you something, but only turn this light on if it's a yes. Earlier, when we were hearing noises but could not see any animal whatsoever, was that something watching us? Okay. Oh my God, right away, dude. That's it. Turn it off, please. Thank you. Oh my God. I'm starting to get hella chills, dude. That was an instant answer. I feel like someone's just staring at us. I know, dude. I'm me it. too. That's the next question I'm gonna ask. Like I legit feel it hard. Don't be afraid. Asking us, can you help me? Come to me, pretty much. Don't be afraid of me. Here's another question before you turn that on. We feel like something is watching us from far away. Is that the creature that is on this piece of land? Turn that on only if it's a yes. Whatever it is, we feel like they're trying to make us trust them enough for them to do something bad to us. I think you were trying to warn us. Yes, you were correct, Wyatt. Yeah. Blanche. Blanche. We've heard that word before. What did that mean before? Blanche, Blanche was... No, 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 no. Blanche means something. Hang on. No f way. What? To balk or hesitate when faced with something unpleasant. That's exactly what That is doing. exactly... Are you trying to say something? Devil. Oh! oh devil! Fat chance, bro. Devil! I said that thing... That creature, that entity, what did people back in the day call something evil? That's the devil. That's the demon. That's, you know what I'm saying? That's evil. This evil, is it a creature? Is it a monster? Formed as something else, not human. Is that what you were trying to warn us about? Threatening. Oh shit, dude. <gasps> Threatening. Now I'm getting f scared, bro. Yeah, getting this scared. is insane. Where are they? Her. Her. It's not they, it's her. What f name have we got twice? Beatrice. Beatrice. Oh, Whoa! F right here. Oh my god. They are here, dude. Oh my f shit, dude. What was that? Did you hear that? What was that? They're here! <gasps> Dude! Dude! Did you hear that scream? I did? What's going on, bro? You're watching from a distance. You're here. We hear you. You might as well just come out. This is heavy shit, boys. My heart's racing. Why are you just staying in there? Right there, just to the left of the camera in the bushes. Right there. I just looked up from my camera, right over here in the bushes. There's two, like, ready orange lights. What? For just a second. Dude, what the f is going on? Why is there something walking in every direction that we have right now? Dude, I'm telling you, man, it, it felt... Dude, somebody's watching us, bro. I know they are. I feel them watching us. I feel it. And we're gonna come back here when the corn's fully risen? Oh, dude, we're screwed. I'm telling you, man, I went there by myself one time. It was a different feeling. Every corner I took, it felt like someone was right there. Get this to 30,000, and when the corn rises, we're gonna do a video here. We're just gonna go ahead and bring the tent. And we'll stay in the middle of the cornfield. 30,000 likes. That moment that we just had was a frickin', I don't know, man, I, I almost like wanted to leave, you know? Right there. I hear it. What the f dude? Behind us, dude! We're surrounded. We're literally surrounded right now. We are so f 
for dinner. All we're trying to do is communicate and find out some information. If you don't give that to us, then there's no point in being here. Beside. 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 I know there's a spirit here with us right now, but there's also something do else. Something? Do you see it? Family. Family. There's also something else. Dude, what is going on with this thing? Beside. That's what's going on. They said that they're next to us. You, you're next to me right now. I said earlier, contain. Maybe that's why it's lurking around us. Dude, contain to this area. The area that I said when I walked right past the tree. Felt weird. Dude, Guys, this is going. This, this is, is a is containment going. thing. Dude, something's up, man. Something's up. Planning. Planning! Oh, this is what things like this do. Creatures like this do. Evil. Something is lurking over there. Let go of that, please. <gasps> Dude, what the actual f just happened? That movement we just heard was just as heavy as before. It was the same shit, just as heavy. Dude, what are you doing? Is somebody here trying to protect us from whatever's spying on us? Planning to hurt us? Is that what you're doing? Curse. Dude, again! I just want to let you know real quick, and I know you probably already understand. These people that live on this land here, they're protected. And whatever is evil, you can continue to not harm them whatsoever. If you don't hurt them, you could continue living here. Killing. Killing, dude. Can I turn this back on? Yeah. This right here, guys, almost reminds me of Churchill. You're right. Oh, that's what You're I'm right. Thinking. Lurking around. What the f That was running. That was full on sprinting. Like I've been saying, skinwalkers are also known to be protectors of something or someone. So this body that is potentially buried here on this land, they could be protecting the body. Oh, shit. They could be protecting the f body. It if we hurt. find this body, it if we came too close to this body, it will hurt us. I think what it's doing right now is making sure that we don't find where this body is. Oh shit. That feels, that doesn't even that sound feels right. right. That feels right. It feels right. Wow. That's crazy, guys. This whole thing is like. Oh! No shit! <laughs> Wait a minute, dude. Oh my god. What? Skinwalkers are said to be Native American spirits, right? So if they did something bad, something went wrong, or whatever, right? The only way to kill it is to know its name. It said her, the evil one. It said her. We got that same name twice. This is her spirit protecting her own body. That is crazy, dude. Daughter. Or. We don't know. That's that, what is going seven on. Seven years old. He's right. It's young. When you asked about the body, is when it said young seven. So why are people afraid of you, though? Why are they saying that you're the devil? You're a demon. You're scary. You're creepy. Is it because of your form? Can you? Good call, dude. I just heard that. Can you explain that? Take photo. Do it again. Oh, bitch! Are we about to find out what the this thing looks like? I just asked what you look like. Yep. Did you hear that? Really? I just heard that. Stand right here, right in front of us, right where that object, that device is going off. That's something moving right there. That was something. Dude. No, dude, don't do that. What? There was running on the ground. Dude, I'm starting to feel. Yeah, man, we I'm might have to, to go. Really feel we fun. might have to go. I hate to say it, guys. This is too much. 
we're gonna make our way away from here. If you have one last thing you want to say or do, now's your chance. I'm, I'm the forest. <gasps> Fat <gasps> chance, bro. Oh no! I was just gonna say we are I'm in the almost forest. Too scared to know what it's about to say. Well, we gotta grab our camera. So. I have a feeling something's gonna happen. I have a really, really bad feeling. True. true. Just said true. I don't want to stay and find out. I'm not gonna lie, man. Somebody's gotta grab. I just said device. true. Yeah, f you. I just saw you, you. F I just saw your eyes. They just ducked down. They just ducked down. We're leaving. All right. We don't want any issues. No problems. I saw you duck right down, like a human being. That was so. F Loud, dude. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm shaking, dude. Here, hold this, please. Oh, you can see it. Look, dude, I'm shaking. I, I swear to God, I saw me. somebody. Hang on, please. Come over here. Yeah, I don't want to go over there. Well, I just want to see you real quick. You got your light? Can you shine it bright? What I saw was literally higher than the bushes, eye level enough to just kind of peek your face. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. My camera died. No, didn't die. Riv, it just paused. Let's go. Look, River shaking. The, like, I'm sorry, man. Crazy. I'm sorry, guys. No, <laughs> nothing on you, dude. That was <laughs> scary as shit. A little embarrassing on my Usually part. It's me. That it. literally sounded like something lunged at us. Yeah. Either that or I don't know. Whatever it was, it was more rustling. For once, we figured it out. Dude, dude we, we actually, we actually pretty much got this whole thing down to the T. If you guys literally, if you want us to come back, we'll come back. 30,000 likes, we'll do it. That just gives us the interaction that you guys actually want it to happen. But we're going to be waiting till that corn is fully stocked. So we cannot see and it's going to be a corn maze and we're going to stay the night right in the middle. With that being said, guys, I think it's time to get the f out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We'll see you next week. Peace. Picasso Asasso. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> My name is Ryan. I've been smoking for oh, 90 years. There's never a time that we can't just be totally serious. <laughs>